क्वेश्चन नंबर 176 सेलेक्ट द ऑप्शन व्हिच करेक्टली आइडेंटिफाइज हार्मोन एक्स एंड मॉलिक्यूल और मॉलिक्यूल्स वाई इन द बिलो गिवन डायग्राम ऑफ मैकेनिज्म ऑफ हार्मोन एक्शन हार्मोन एक्स इज बाइंडिंग विद द रिसेप्टर प्रेजेंट इन द सेल मेम्ब्रेन दिस इंडिकेट दिस एक्स हार्मोन इज अ वाटर सॉल्युबल हार्मोन water soluble hormone as they do not enter into the cell they generate second messenger so why is second messenger let's look into the options option number 1 estrogen ip3 estrogen is a steroid hormone it is lipid soluble so this option cannot be our correct answer option number 2 fsh fsh is a water soluble hormone and it generates second messenger cyclic amp so this is correct and correct answer to this question option number 3 cortisol cortisol is again a steroid hormone so this option cannot be a correct answer Option number 4 progesterone cyclic AMP progesterone is a steroid hormone a lipid soluble hormone so this cannot be a correct answer correct answer to this question is option number 2 let's move on to the next question question number 177 development of male pattern secondary sexual characters like facial hair growth and low pitch of voice in women occur in disorder and the options given are adrenal virilism gynecomastia cone syndrome and addison's disease adrenal virilism it is due to hyper secretion of sex corticoids in females which results into development of male pattern secondary sexual characters like facial hair growth and low pitch of voice in women so correct answer to this question is option number 1 second option gynecomastia gynecomastia occurs when estrogen level increases and testosterone level decreases in males and this results into development of breast in males and the condition is called gynecomastia option number 3 cone syndrome it is due to hyper secretion of corticosteroids option number 4 addison's disease it is due to hyper secretion of glucocorticoids and mineralocorticoids so correct answer to this question is option number 1 let's move on to the next question question number 178 choose the option which contains only incorrect statements statement a insulin is not given orally because digestive enzymes break it down before it could exert its function this is a correct statement statement b thyroxin shows calorigenic effect this is also a correct statement because thyroxin increases bmr as a result it shows calorigenic effect statement c the hormones produced during emotional stress is oxytocin this is an incorrect statement because in emotional stress cortisol and catecholamines are released catecholamines are adrenaline and nor adrenaline statement d adrenaline does not influence the carbohydrate metabolism this is incorrect because in presence of adrenaline glucose level increases incorrect statements are c and d which is given in the option number 2 so correct answer to this question is option number 2 let's move on to the next question question number 179 what is correct to say about the hormone action in humans option number 1 in the absence of receptors the hormone will not produce their effects on target tissues or organ this is a correct statement hormone action is not possible without receptors option number 2 receptor of thyroxin is a membrane bound protein 
this is incorrect because thyroxin is a lipid soluble hormone and its receptors are present inside the cell intracellular receptors option number 3 erythropoietin activates bone marrow cells to suppress rbc production this is incorrect because erythropoietin stimulates rbc production Option number four, gonadotropic hormones are secreted by adrenal cortex. This is incorrect because gonadotropic hormones, that is FSH and LH, are secreted by anterior pituitary, not adrenal cortex. So, correct statement is statement one. So, correct answer to this question is option number 1. Let's move on to the next question, which is last question of zoology section. That is question number 180. In the event of encountering an emergency situation of life or death, the emergency hormones do not. Emergency hormones are adrenaline and noradrenaline. Increase heart and breathing rate. These are functions of emergency hormones. Option number two, break down lipids and proteins. These are also functions of emergency hormones. Option number three, stimulate the process of glycogenesis. This is incorrect. Because emergency hormones stimulate the process of glycogenolysis. That is, breakdown of glycogen into glucose and hence blood glucose level increases option number fourth cause dilation of pupil this is also a function of emergency hormones so third option is not the function of emergency hormones so correct answer to this question is option number three with this question, I would like to end zoology discussion of this test. I hope all your doubts and queries have been solved. Thank you so much for watching and best of luck for your next exam.